All right, so we are done with the 405 show on the street, um, racing our daily drivers or extreme daily drivers or whatever you, true street, whatever you want to call these cars. You know, I don't know what you call them, but everybody's got a different pro mod. You call them, what? Well, Damon's got a pro mod, right? Damon's definitely, it's an X275 car, sorry. Not a pro mod, an X275 yeah. car. So, um, and we had a pretty good year. Um, I mean, we came out not one to lose one race. Um, we ended up going, what, 14 and four? 14 and four, yeah. And those four losses were Josh's fault because he does the power management. I just drive it, so it can't be my fault. Um, just kidding. Josh, don't cry. I'm not gonna cry. <laughs> so, <laughs> you've never hit anybody in your life. I almost did. Almost, <laughs> close. Not on close. TV, though. Not on close, TV. you almost, you have, have you ever punched a wall or anything? Uh, I kicked a door. <laughs> <laughs> Note to self, note to everyone, do not kick the doorknob, kick the actual door. Because it's easier to replace the door than it is the door jam. <laughs> this guy, it's kind of my youngest brother. My youngest brother, he talks a lot of shit, and I don't think he's ever I been thought in, about it before. He's I never been in too. a fight, ever. you never Let's been in a fight. Let's not talk about that. Well, no, it's just funny. Yeah. I, I, mean, I grew up fighting, so to me, when somebody, like, sure, you got in a fight with another little kid or something at one point, right? I mean, yeah. Really That's we're going to start like this. Yeah, we're going to start like fighting. <laughs> All right, so Josh can't fight. Y'all don't pick on him because I'll have to punch you in the hey, face. Hey, Reaper gave you some credit, though. Reaper, after all that went down, he came over and said, you know, like, what do you say? What do you say? Y'all got into it in the middle of that. Yeah, we did season. get in the middle of it, too. But th didn't he come over and say something to you after that? I don't know. He's like, man, that Josh guy, he's, he's pretty legit or something like that. I, yeah, I can't I remember. Said so. I've slept since then, yeah. Josh. Your feet move so damn fast. I don't know how you went from over there to over there in like 1.2 seconds. What happened? Oh, when you were chasing that guy with your arm up there? Yeah. <laughs> they like, just showed that on TV. They did. They had memes about it. Josh, <laughs> Josh running. Like seven people pushed the poor kid. Uh, and then Josh running across the parking lot like this. I go, who are you doing? He's like, I'm hit him. <laughs> like you're advertising? Like you had a billboard? Like you don't start from up here. Oh, he goes, well, I've never punched anybody, Chuck. But that guy was going to punch. And then Aiden snatched me up. Yeah. And Dave big, just laughing. Dave is just laughing in the background. If you saw him, he just laughing and shaking his head. Well, I, I'm at the other end going, yep, another All truck. Right. Down. So, so we're going to talk about that? Yeah. So, um, obviously, Ben Head, um, he came out, helped us this season. He did all the tuning on the car. Josh does the power management. I Kevin just comes and hangs out, drinks beer, and, and looks good. He rides in the backseat of the truck, so it don't, you know, it's smoother <laughs> ride stuff, you know. So just He kidding. holds the car really well. He does. Yeah. So this is my crew this year that we, we did on the street, and, and we did, you know, and, and for us, you know, we got thrown all the fast cars. We did. You know, I don't like making excuses about my four losses. My, my four losses, I lost them. That's, we lost them. But we had to race the fastest guys from every single team. So we raced some good competition. So if we could have got some of them races at Kamikaze race and stuff, we would have went undefeated. But I want, you know, I'm a team player, and I felt like I had, when me and you were testing before we started filming, we, we kind of told the guys, like, hey, man, this is how fast we're going. They're like, yeah, no way. They thought we were bullshitting. And I'm like, no, really, that's how fast we're going. And I thought they were bullshitting. Yeah. We all did. We all thought they were bullshitting. Yeah, well... And they then, we, then we go racing. I'm like, ooh, shit, their, their shit's a lot slower. <laughs> but everybody stepped up. Even we went faster. Um, we got faster the, the last night of testing. We, yeah. And then uh, every race we raced, obviously, what, it was three races in? But, I mean, even that road the on uh, at Oak City, like, the first night, you're like, it went a 605 or 601 or something right. like that. And it ended up going at 581. Right, but, but that 601 was like... Four tenths faster than everybody there. Right at the time. Yeah, yeah, and everyone right. kind of caught us, but we but did go. Faster. How many races we, we raced? We ran out of fuel basically after. But how many races was that? That was like what? Eighteen Which one? or sixteen races in? Like we we it was halfway through the season. When what? When we ran out of fuel and being oh, able to put no, injectors we were like in it. Done, so, no, we were done like the first week. Well, like it was, we, we didn't no, need it until. Yeah, it was done the first week. Like. We yeah. had this idea of... Because we, we tried turning it up a little Josh's bit more. Josh's idea and it was of how to do this and what Chuck did were complete, two completely different things. What's that? Well, I said if, if we go out and we're faster than everybody, we don't need a Greyhound bus everyone. We just need to like hold back and not show all of our cards. And like two nights in, we've got That's a full deck laid out and, and turn it up and wanting a scramble button and all this other stuff. Well, we, I was we, like, we, we, we couldn't have a scramble button. <laughs> 
because we were out of fuel. So when Ben, right, when ben tuned it, yeah, we put the ID what we, ID 1300s in 1300. it, and I said, I wanted hazards. I told Ben, I go, look, when we got it on the dyno, I want hazard button, and I want a uh, scramble button. Yep. And it worked. And then this year, next season, we got some more help. And obviously, everybody's going to get faster every season. I don't know if you can use the power on the road, but obviously, we're going to do better even next year. So, But we went 14-4. and four. The best record out of the 405, and uh, you know, it's it's a uh, I've been number one on the list for a couple seasons and stuff, but then but you know, but Ryan's been number one, Sean's been number one, hell, Doc's been number one, you know, Dave's been number one, so it, it all we all push each other to go fast, but um, I think we put it we put in a good amount of work and uh, and it paid off. I think that was amazing about watching you guys is everybody picked up after the first race, it was like. Yeah. Everybody. They went home and put all their. I mean, they did their homework and. Well, and and we were out testing while they were in. Um, they they Vegas. were finishing uh, in Vegas. What yeah. was that? Whatever the show that was, but they were in Vegas. So we tested the whole time they were in Vegas. So they were behind when they showed up. They were definitely behind, but it didn't take them long to catch back up. And then you know, look at Doc's car. Look how fast it got the last night of racing. Like yeah. Doc he, took a swing with the He tire, took a swing and it worked. And it worked. He he put he had right. two hundred shot of nitrous and he put a radial on it and it worked. Yeah. Almost. When I when I heard that he put a radial on, I was like, we should have done that. Well, I, I wanted to do I, that, but I didn't have the balls to do it. I I, I, I agree. You know? But I think halfway through the season we could have done it. Yeah. So. And yeah, he was I, on a Hoosier radial. Yeah. So I mean, his, hey, you can't take away from saying, him. Just saying, that's what he was on. You know, like. Yeah. So it worked. Well, he, he went. He went fast, and, and like I said, I uh, I didn't think I really. I wanted that Honda, the first or second round, um, because I thought I was the only one that could probably outrun him. And I said, if he if he goes rounds, he's gonna get faster every single round, and he's gonna win this whole fucking thing. And look what happened. The Honda wins. So Aaron's a good kid. I like Aaron. I've been I raced with him back in 2004 forever, and he's still doing the import stuff. So hats off to him and Jason Herrera. I mean, they earned it, and. Uh, I wish I'd have been in the final. I feel like I'd have got it done, but I slipped up racing Damon. And uh, Josh, I told Josh when he put new tires on it, he wouldn't listen to me. <laughs> He's a liar. He's a liar, son of a bitch. <laughs> Josh is like, man, you think we ought to change the tires? I'm like, shit, man, fuck them tires. We don't need yeah. new tires. I had a brand new set sitting here in the. Sh and I go, I don't want to put new tires on just for the just for the last weeks. I go, we need to go break them in and stuff. I go, ah, it'll be fine. Well, yeah, I'll just let you know. It was not right. Josh was right. Chuck was wrong. Is that better? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's so he cost cool. me those four losses or three of them. <laughs> but that last one, that last one, David, not on me. It has so much wheel Duh. speed, and it was like that's it, the only time the car ever did that. The I whole know. time out it, of the eighteen passes, that was the I only know. time it ever lost a tire early like that. Part of it was the road was getting a little greasy, but I don't the like making excuses. Really I don't like yeah. making excuses. And, and there we, was certain people who that was you weren't, that weren't have been playing been, by the rack. No, they they were we playing did. by the rules, but they weren't following the team well, advice. Well, right, we right. talked about it, and, and they the team's like, "Hey guys, stuff. use water, use water," and yeah. they're like, "Yeah, no, I'm not using water. Fuck, I use water." <coughs> Monza, but it, then it fucks the guy behind him. Yeah, but fucked up. It, 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 no, it's not an excuse. I know, I'm not. But saying he did it twice. Me. He did it to me twice. But I know he did. But okay, but listen, all we had to do is, you know me, all we got to do is scoot over a little bit, do two burnouts, yeah. and I'll leave him on tracks. That but fucking the, car works. But they've so, been told numerous times. But I don't know that in the car. They in the car, been, I'm just. I know. If you the road's know. greasy, y'all gotta tell me, or y'all just gonna go. Just but they, but they've been told numerous times. Mm, I mean, they were the only. Well, him and Sean were the only ones that were using that stuff. And so you're saying Monza's not a team player? <laughs> Josh and asked Monza, whoop his ass. <laughs> Watch he's out, never Monza. hit nobody. <laughs> he, it'll be the first time he's ever hit anybody. You'll see it coming. <laughs> he's gonna run across the parking lot, and then we'll send the video to his wife at church. <laughs> Embarrassing. They'll play it on the big screen. I'll just hide his cigarettes. <laughs> then he won't be able to function. Yeah, I know exactly. But overall, I mean, it was a great season. Obviously, we're going to make the car faster. We have to, um, you know, and we beat some fast people. We did. And the truck, it's kind of cool. talk about the orange truck thing? Yeah. Let's talk about it. What about it? So, I I don't, I wasn't, we weren't, whatever you want to call it, we weren't afraid of the orange truck. No. But there were some basic rules to this situation. No, it was the other truck. No. The no, orange that, truck no, was okay. the one that the took truck, yeah, 17 okay. so, seconds to spool. Yeah, I didn't care about He that. said, I got to okay, go in second truck. because I spooled Manny's, so fast. Manny's truck, the first night of Street Wars, like the whole tire thing. I don't care what tire you're on, and I don't care what tire you race somebody else on. 
But when you're racing us, like that's what I care about. It, I was in the car. I, I, I know you were in the car, and you didn't care. You didn't I have know. anything to do with that. I that was actually. Was, well, I mean, rules are rules. Rules are I, rules, and that's where me being the track queer racer, like I've always raced by rules. Right. right. So. I don't care if you raced on that tire last time you were here. That was the other person's problem right. that year. Well, they didn't have a choice because we were already on the starting line, so they either had to back up or right. try to argue it. So I don't. And I didn't them. think we were going to lose, but rules are rules. You know, yeah. like you come and we're all racing by the same. Well, I, I promise you, Manny rules. wants that race back because Manny would have been more patient the second time and grabbed that scramble button, not thirty foot off the starting line. Well, he hopefully shows up on the right tire this time too. <laughs> but. You know, that truck, I mean, the problem is, I think, if he'd have been out in front of me, he wouldn't have grabbed it so soon. But when we took off, he could see me, so right. he just grabbed it and added it. I mean, that truck makes a lot of power. It's a cool truck. It does. They're cool so. trucks. But I just wanted to, like, that wasn't, you know, it, and I, I didn't, I wasn't even mad up there. I was just like, hey, it's on the wrong tire. And then Sean goes, well, Josh White. Yeah. Mad, <laughs> no, I was, not, that was over Javi's deal. That guy tried to stiff Javi on the money. Yeah. You know? So, but, no, I just wanted to say the tire thing was... It yeah. was one of those deals. Like, well, you show up and race on the right tire. Like, if, if we would have showed up on a 29, we wouldn't have been racing. Oh, yeah. It no, wouldn't have happened. No, no, hell no. You know, like, they would have not let that happen. So, why is it any different for some four wheel drive thing? Didn't somebody? Oh, the uh, Pennsylvania well, guys had 29. But that, didn't, that, that didn't matter at all. Those were small tires. Nobody tire. cared. <laughs> they go, that is a small tire. And I was like, yeah. fuck. So, no, that's Yeah, two matter. of their cars showed up on 29s, but. Yeah. There was multiple cars that showed up that really didn't fit the rules. Yeah, there was a few of them, but. I mean, but. There's going to be, you know, these guys are racing on the street, and this is what they've got. You know, just like J-Rod's deal, it had a funny car cage. We said no funny car cages. I spent a lot of money taking the funny car cage out of my car um, and making it look right, and then they let J-Rod in, which I like J-Rod, and I like his Supra, so and I was the, glad to see it on the show. And then Durango cut the funny car cage out of his car. Yeah, so see. It so, had a funny car so cage, then and see, he cut it out. J-Rod should have done it, because if that guy cut it out, then J-Rod should have done it. I agree. Anyway, it is what it is. So there's, you know, there's a little bit of. There's always going to be a little something. Everybody's going to break the rules. It wouldn't be fun if they didn't break the rules. But it didn't hurt us. Nobody we raced. Um, I'm still got pissed off. I got beat by that fucking Honda. Fucking Aaron. God damn it. But you know, that was a long drive home that night. Man, it sucked. I'm like, because I knew better. And I didn't see him, so I was already like celebrating. And then I heard him, and I grabbed a scramble button right at the finish line. It's too late. And I was like, my bad. I go, I think I beat you. And he goes, I don't think you did. I go, oh, I beat you. I get back there, they're like, they're cheering. I'm like, fuck. God damn it, Chuck. So, that was on me. And then the black car race, his car was fast. He swung at it. He made a pass. And he put about, a, what, a bumper on me or something? Yeah, a bumper. Yep. Yeah. He, he was, his car was fast. Can't take that away from him. The silver car we raced, even we overpowered the road. He won the race fair and square. And then Damon, you know, Damon was moving around too. I haven't watched the rerun jet of it, but you know my car was moving around and Damon came to the center too. But I was, I mean, mine was completely out of shape. It was I'd have gone. I could have yeah. probably tried to pedal a little bit further and maybe I could have done something. But he was moving around too. But you know, like it, it ain't worth wrecking the car. And uh, you know, I was at my limit, so I know when. Do you have a limit? Mm, yeah. Wow. I, do. I, do I thought a, that was when you wrecked the car. No, I don't uh, how many cars you see me wreck? I'm just, I well, I mean. Not very many, but you'll yeah. drive it to the scene of the crash. I will. I mean, I, you can scrape a wall. That's not wrecking it. Yeah. That's not wrecking the car. Wrecking the car is sticking in the wall and flipping over the wall. And, and I mean, the rolling. nicest car you have sitting in here is the one you don't race. Oh. So what does that tell you? A few scrapes. And, I mean, you gotta you got to be able to lean on shit. God damn In his defense, he puts 400 passes on They do race the shit out of stuff. I'm, yeah. I'm just not scared to scrape a wall to win a race. That doesn't bother me. So... But yeah, I never, Rub and never crashed a wall. Crashed a car. Well, there's no Not walls in, out there, so yeah. Well, there's curbs field. and yeah. fields, field, field, dirt, and Les has found all them fields. <laughs> so it's Caleb. Caleb did too. Caleb found that field out, and that's guys a long time ago. That was the same field though. It was. Yeah. yeah. Overall, yeah. successful season. And you do own the car. Four. I know how. Well, I'm just saying there was questions about. Oh, there was. Yeah. You yeah. do own the car. It's not my car. So at, originally, before the season started, 
Josh owned the car before the season started, yes. and I was going to lease it from him because I didn't have time to build a car because we raced no prep kings. Right. And then once they had to cut out the funny car cage, Josh said, man, fuck this gay-ass street outlaw <laughs> shit. I ain't doing The group text. Dumb the shit. group text had me wore out before the race. Well, everybody was bitching. Jeff Lutz was throwing a fucking pissy fit about it had a funny car cage. And I said, I thought we just had to cut off the driver's side. No, you got to cut the whole thing out. I was like... Well, then make up your mind. So they personally told me. So they all bitched about it. And Josh says, you know what? You should just buy the fucking car. Yeah. So I'm like, That's okay. a 12th hour. Like, so literally. I, yeah. So I bought it right before we started racing. So I do own the car. But at, originally, I was going to lease it from you right. to race this season until I can build some. So Did you know 57 Chevy Bel Airs come with spindle mount wheels yes, on the front of Yes, from the factory. Them? Yeah, from yeah. the factory, though. That's not a race car. That's not a race car. Yeah. It's slow as it is. Race car. Just saying. I, I mean, know you got. I know you had to find something to give me. I, it didn't bother me. They they can talk all the shit they want. They said Chuck bought a ringer and all that shit. That piece of shit didn't fucking work when I bought it. You sold me some junk. <laughs> well, t- no, that's not true. It that fucking is true. Track. That, that is piece not of shit true wouldn't leave on three pounds all. of boost at the track. Uh, that thing was wouldn't get out of its own way. You could run faster than that car go. That was not my fault. It wasn't. It was but, not my fault at all. <laughs> <laughs> That was, but that was a that's dick, why that thing that was a dick move right there. That was not my fault. <laughs> well, you sold me a piece of shit. No, it didn't work. Did so anyway, not. ten thousand dollars later, and all this badass suspension shit. Now it'll leave it on a gravel road now. So it will. Yes. But that's part of testing and trying. If we just showed up in the first race, that yeah, embarrassing. How many converters did we put in? Just one, just, right? Yeah, just one. We put yeah. one. Yeah, we had the we changed oil once. Well, yeah. Ben and I put a converter in it. We had the transmission out of it. The transmission was out of it twice. Oh, that's right. Because it broke the transmission, and then we put a oh, converter. Oh, I had to go bail you out. At you did have to bail me out. I had a. You broke I, it. He had a. He I had, had a moment. Put the had transmission a in. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. I'm not a mechanic. <laughs> it's a power glide, bro. It's a long story. It's like three bolts. I'm not a mechanic. Okay, I got it. I get it. That's another thing. Okay. Like people ask if I have a shop. I have a shop. Do you build signs? I have a sign shop. Yeah, sign shop. I make signs. Yeah. Yeah. Stickers, and signs, I have, and I have a bad race car habit, but I don't have a shop. Oh. So, and I don't tune cars. Not a tuner. No, Ben's the tuner. Ben's the tuner. Ben's the tuner. You the power management I'm guy. Power management. And Kevin Griggs there. Data <laughs> analyst. Yes. And gets chairs. Hey, he's still yeah. ice in them. Hey, he hey he went and found he went and stole a golf cart every single night of filming. I did bring the ice chest to us like every night. Well, I stole the golf cart initially. Originally. Got us in all the trouble. <laughs> What but was then, her name? Nancy. 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 Yeah, Nancy. Nancy. Yeah, I seen her coming. We're loading ice chips. Oh my gosh, she's She goes, You can't buy anything because I seen her, all my ice chips over here. And they're like, you come back, Y'all come back over there. I'm like, Oh man, they're mad as fuck. We took yeah. the production was not happy about I thought they were going to kick us out. <laughs> yeah, you say, hey, I, I just borrowing it. I saw some other guy who isn't anybody. They probably else. asked. No, he didn't ask. I don't think he asked either. Well, maybe. Well, obviously, y'all didn't ask. He didn't ask. They well, well he just found one of the keys the deal, in it. The deal is, is Nancy's hood, so she saw all of us. She saw us stalking the golf cart. Yeah. No, we were stalking it the golf cart. It had her, yeah, her, her name yeah. on it, too. We were looking for one of the keys in it. She's like, I saw you guys over there scoping all those golf carts. And I just jacked one them. and rode off. And here she comes. Oh. Next, uh, Nancy's from Miami. She don't fuck yeah. around. Yeah. yeah, she's she just stabbed you. Told me, yeah, she wanted to stab your ass beat. Hey, well, when she was banging on the hood, whose name is on this motherfucker? <laughs> <laughs> and then we became friends with but her. But then we, yeah, Nancy yeah. took care of us every night. Yeah. Brought us chairs, food. Mm. Yep. Uh, like yeah. took care of us. Yeah. Hey, no prep king. She was with us. And yeah. Man, she'd bring us care package every weekend. Nancy she was always was bringing shit. some weird donuts and stuff over there. Yeah. yeah, she did. She definitely took care of us. So. Talk about your hair. What's wrong with my hair? Nothing. There's so, wrong obviously, I'm out of my sling. It <laughs> doesn't. is a terrible idea. <laughs> it doesn't terrible stop. idea. <laughs> no, no. It's, I mean, I'm not physical, but it's, it's, it's. I mean, it works as good as it did before I had surgery. So now it'll be. Uh, so I'm out of my sling. I can shave my head now, but I just thought I'd let it grow a little bit. So what's wrong with it? So this dude, I called him the other day. I've shaved my head for this, 23 this, years. This story. I called him the other day, and he tells me, I'm out of my sling. And then he, he I'm on the phone with him, not FaceTiming him or anything. I'm on the phone with him, and he's telling me how he can move his shoulder. And I hear him, like, grunting. I'm like, Chuck, I'm not there. I can't see you. You don't have to do it. Don't hurt yourself. I was on this ride. And he's doing it the whole up, thing. I, she said, crawl I'm up the wall, crawl my, down the wall. So I crawled up the deal. I was talking to Josh. Josh's like, dude, I'm not there. I can't see you. We're not on FaceTime. Stop. Yeah, you can hear him struggling, uh, 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 and I'm just crying on the other side, because he's doing it. I'm, I can't see a damn thing. All I hear him is moaning. It sounds like he's going to die, and I'm just crying on the phone. Oh, it's like, stop, you're retarded. I am retarded. Yeah, you no, are. I've never claimed 
that I wasn't retarded. Where did, you, where did you get and the it's jail Riri. from? The Walmart. Oh. Yeah, Why? I was just wondering. I, mean, I, don't, I don't go to salons or nothing. I, I didn't even know. recognize you when you walked up. Look at my nails, yeah. how long they are. I, just, I thought, I mean, is, maybe this a, is this another Well, because nobody's... Yet? I've shaved my head for 23 years. And so I think everybody thought I was just bald. I did. I mean, I shave it every other day. I shave it off. So, no, it grows. This is what, it's about a whole five? Man. It's like five weeks. Five, maybe six weeks, maybe. I could have Monza hair. <laughs> so, I don't know that you want Monza hair. <laughs> no. Nah. Might as well throw a cigarette in your mouth, yeah. too. Nah. Put a cigarette in your mouth, you put anything in your mouth. <laughs> so my daddy told me. So, uh, yeah, no, I don't know what I want to do. I'm going to let it grow. My, my kids think it's funny because my kids are 18. My youngest two kids are 18 and 15, and they've never seen me with hair. Never. They've never seen pictures with me with hair. So it's kind of odd to When them. you turned the corner, I swear, I thought you were another brother. I didn't know you were. I thought, man, I didn't even, I don't know who this guy is. Yeah. Yeah, because last time you saw me, it was bubble. All right. So, yeah, as soon as I got the sling on, I was like, oh, yeah, I'm not going to be able to shave this. This ain't going to work. So I just, and I didn't have no help. So. I just said, eh, I'll just let it grow. And my kids made fun of me, so I looked like a chia pet. It just kept, it was like spiky. And it, now it's like getting long enough where it kind of almost, you can almost do something with it. So I either got to go get a haircut or shave it off one other. So. so yes, I got hair. Is that what you want to know? Yeah. Okay. How much hair you got? Not very much. Okay. From so don't talk people like you. <laughs> <laughs> well, mine's gray from all, the women made all this gray. There's a three reason why Three dollars and all that linen. I've never been a hat guy. I'm just not kind of look goofy in a hat, so I'm just not never been a hat guy. Yeah, speak, speaking of Lutz, we're in California, and he sees me without a hat on. He goes, you're bald as hell. And I was like, really? Like, look at you, yeah. sir. Yeah. Like, what the fuck? Come on. Well, that's the one I have no hair Hot meat kettle? And you're a lot older than I am. Yeah. Actually, all you motherfuckers are a lot older than I am. How old are you? I'm 39. Are you really? Yeah. You're a pup. Yeah. Yeah. It's like when you guys started. No, I was still old. <laughs> I gotta do the math. You gotta do the math. Yeah, yeah I was pause. 42 when we 42 started. 42 when you started. Yeah. So, yeah, 53 years old. Lutz, that makes Lutz like 70. 71? <laughs> Lutz is like 71 years old, I think. Are you 71, Lutz? If I'm 53, you gotta be like 71 or 80. Just kidding. Not very Lutz is younger than me. <laughs> Lutz, is, Lutz is two years younger than me. So, so I think Monza. Doc are the only two that are older than I am. So is everybody building a new car except us? Nobody nobody built new cars. Everybody, so uh, everybody's, our car did pretty good. And Ryan is not going to sit still and have a car that's equal with mine. He's got to build something that's better than mine. Same with Sean. Sean uh, just needed more power. Sean's going to keep the 55, but did, is Ryan not racing the gold car? Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 It's got a brand new L L L L M E L M E motor in it with twin turbos. Mm -hmm. Sean's got I don't know what motor Sean's got, but it's got twin turbos. They both made 17, 16, 80 or something. Awesome. And then uh, Ryan's is dual fuel. It's got a it's a super unleaded and E eighty five. And uh, <laughs> so uh, and I mean, but yeah, Sean's got good power. Ryan's <laughs> dual fuel. I've got some oceanfront property down the street for you here in Oklahoma, by the way, if you believe that. <laughs> well, I, the problem is I don't think we I just don't, well, well, 28 10 fives on shady-ass streets, we're not going to need that much power. Like, we're just not. But I'm not going to sit here and leave my stock Coyote motor in it when they're making 1700 So that's why I reached out to John Yurst, and John Yurst built me a motor. We're going to put the Hellion turbos on it, and it will make 1700 Now, if we only use 500 that's cool, but it, it will make 1700 horsepower. And if we put bigger turbos on it, it can make 2000 2100 if we need to. But his 64s, his new Hellion turbos, six, the 64 millimeters, will make 1700 horsepower. So, cool. That's what we're going to start off with. Plenty. So, and if you fucking lose one of this... <laughs> I'm going to put something in your contract this year. It's going to talk about losses. Losses. You're going to get some kind of deduction or something. You're going to ride the back of the truck on the way home or something. There's got to be some. <laughs> got to be consequences to your losing. Consequences to my losing. Because I didn't have no driver error. Uh, there was no driver errors this year. Well, you didn't grab the scramble a couple of times. It's not my fault. It should have been faster. <laughs> <laughs> no, they were all my fault. 
I take blame. No, it's okay. I don't. It's I take okay. blame for everything. I don't. Team, I try not to make effort. excuses. Yeah, it was a team effort. We did good. We kicked ass. Um, we're obviously. If if I lost four, that means I won fourteen too. You did. You did. You won fourteen Stop. and lost four, and I won fourteen and lost four. Like I said Dan last time, my wife four. probably could have drove the car. Fuck off! It ain't that fucking easy. <laughs> goddamn it, motherfucker! I can cut light. You didn't see the only guy that I let that beat me off the line was Rusty Beaver. That's the only guy that beat me off the line. I, I think maybe the black Mustang could have been like a toss up. Nah, we were we were we, they, we both let Santa. Rusty Beaver definitely. I was a little lazy on the light and he nailed it. So Rusty Beaver definitely cut the line. Other than that, about Rusty Beaver, Rusty Beaver. Rusty Beaver. Rusty Beaver. Beaver. That's his real name, by the way. Yeah. That's his, I'm just yeah. saying, people probably don't believe that. It's not a stage name. Well, that's a, we're in Oklahoma. That's 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 his real name. <laughs> <laughs> we're a little redneck over here, but um. He beat me off the light, so I did a good job. So don't just sit there and say anybody can drive a fucking car. Like nobody can talk shit like. Well, me. no one would have handled the Fabergé egg the way Ben and I did either. It would have been in a million pieces. I but guarantee you, I, I can't drive even. Them. I can't tune the rods right out of it. <laughs> I, God damn! For, for sure. Egg gaskets, for sure. Yeah, for um, sure. I mean, I couldn't tune. I can't even open Holly, so I'm. Yeah, at I'm least you're honest. Though. Yeah, other people aren't so honest. They I think they can, but they I'm can't. like, oh yeah, I don't know what. What's that square? Up? Is that a radiator? <laughs> you click on it, you're like, fuck, can't get out of it. Just unplug it. Unplug yeah, it. I'm just, yeah, I'm not that guy. So I've gotten really familiar with fuel tech. I still don't claim to, I'm not a tuner, but I've, I'm have i very familiar with fuel tech, but I'm still not. I just, I'd rather just drive the car. So. And sign off. And sign off. Sign off, yeah, it's kind of hard. It so. is. And you give people, you give them. I give them a lot of time. You give them a lot of time. You give them, you give them, them the full but, experience. But I sign anything. I never. I don't turn people down for autographs. So. What's the weirdest thing you've ever signed? I mean, I've signed everything. <laughs> I haven't signed a, a dick yet. I've signed boobies. I've signed. <laughs> I've signed you asses. Had to, you had to sign. I even <laughs> signed some man boobs. This some dude man said, boobs? He said, "Will you sign my man boobs?" I'm like, I mean, I fuck. I guess if you want me to. And I did. I've signed a lot of shit. Signed some women's cooters. Wow. Yep. But I've never. One guy wanted me asked me if I signed his dick, and I was like, yeah, I'm not touching your dick. Was that that? Was he from Tulsa? No. <laughs> <laughs> Turned to weird stuff. No, it like was actually. I was actually at Ennis. Oh. It was actually at Ennis. He was drunk. He goes, Chuck, man, will you sign? Come on, man. I'm <laughs> my dick. I go. My name is not gonna fit on your dick. If you are, you should be in the movies. Because you know how long Chuck Sightsinger is. It's not gonna fit. Okay. We can get my initial CS, but if that thing's hard, I'm not getting you in there anyway. <laughs> I'm gonna get TJ to come over and sign. <laughs> So yeah, no, I signed a lot of stuff. I signed a lot of stuff in my lifetime. So that's oh, it. we're missing something in here. What are we missing? There's a car gone. Well, because it's, it's at. I took it to Mike Crisp in Amarillo, and he is. He started on it when I dropped it off, and he said it'll be ready in a couple weeks. So maybe we start testing. I mean, we're not going to race that car anytime soon, but it'd still be fun to go out and play with it. But you had wrapped the fenders. I had wrapped the fenders. And so everybody thinks it's like an iridescent color because it's like, they're like, man, it kind of changes colors. It does change Because it has a wrap on the front right, fenders yeah. and the rest of the car is green. Yeah. I don't know what the color of that green way. is. It's some kind of Ford green, I think. Yeah, I think it's like a jewel green or something yeah. like that. I like I the color know. of it, so I'm going back with the same color. But he's going to trim the fenders out, fix all the dents. The car is actually really rare because it's like a pale yellow or soft yellow. Like, that's the actual original color. No, I never car, found no which yellow. Which is like... Oh, there's yellow in it. Yeah. yeah. But it's actually yellow, like, or tropical yellow or something like that. It's actually a really rare color. I have a yellow one at Duffy's sitting out back. You do. You're, you're right. right. Yeah. Hatchback. Sitting there waiting for whatever. I don't know what I'm going to build it for, but I'm going to build it for something. Yeah. So, backup car or something. I don't know. So, but, so, so all we got to do is have fun. And you got you got a car now. I do. So, well, you bought. I had a, several cars, but yeah. I, a Mustang, and then uh, you yeah. bought it for some guy to put a Chevrolet motor in it. <laughs> no. Oh, my, the must. Oh, yeah, the one you well, just bought. Well, someone asked about my red S197, and I, yes, I did own a, rest, a red S197 car that went to Amarillo, mm -hmm. and then it went somewhere else, and then I bought it back. It was a bad idea the first time, it was the worst idea the second time. <laughs> so. Well, yeah, but now you gotta. You... Yeah, so then I sold that car, and now I bought uh, like a Dragon Drive. Yeah, style car. Yeah, because the guy just did uh, sick week, didn't he? And now he did it. Well, no, he did it in twenty twenty two. Oh, okay. Yeah, in Rocky okay. Mountain Race Week. Okay. But I bought a. <laughs> this is kind of funny because I'm pretty diehard Ford, but I actually bought a LS Swap Mustang. They're they're pretty common. So. Yeah. Yeah. <coughs> it just, just be a little swap. faster than a Coyote. Yeah. 
Yeah. You that just, was very hard for me to say out loud. You just swallowed really hard. Like, <laughs> yeah, that was, yeah. uh, you had to swallow But it's really cool. Yeah, I, I, I mean, I'm a, I, like, tailpipes. I like Chevrolets. I like Fords. I, I, I'm not really a it's hater fast. on It's fast. That's all that matters. That's all, that's, that's, it's like it's kind of like the farm truck of Mustangs. Yeah. I haven't seen it. You told me about it, so I'm, I'm excited. That's why I wanted you to take it to Hinton. Yeah. So we can go race it, but I know if you're scared, you're scared. I get it. I'm not. Oh, jeez. Here we go. <laughs> I told you I'll drive it. I haven't even raced it yet. I know. I was going to race I'll it, do it today, but there was a hiccup. Timing at system. The track, so. Fix the damn timing systems. We'll go to the track. It was 75 today. Yeah. Fucking idiots. <laughs> wow. Track, well, the track just got new people, new owners, and obviously they don't have a timing system guy. They've been working on it for a couple of weeks trying to get it done. Me. And the timing system is 30 plus. I would just buy a new one. Right. I just buy one. I would. I mean, it's a new facility, or not new facility, but new owners, and you don't want them problems during a big bracket race. What if you have some big two hundred thousand dollar bracket race in the time like system? NHRA divisional. Yes, exactly. It's happened. Okay, so <laughs> get rid of it. Just just yeah. fix it. Every track we've been to around the nation, you know, lightning strikes it, fries them. Hey, everybody's got spare. All these big tracks come down. Like, I mean, within thirty minutes to an hour, it's fixed. Yeah. No matter what's why, wrong with it. Why do you care about timing system at your race? I don't. We care. don't get time slips. No, I'm just saying. You, nice go, if we did. you wanted a time slip. You're a track guy. I am a track guy. Okay, so that, yeah, that's that's so the crappy you, part about racing MPK. I don't have any time slips. So if the if the timers didn't work, but they would still let you in, would you have gone? If the timers didn't, like no, I wouldn't. See, no, not, that's why I just see said. me. I that's can test, and I know how. I my, my butthole will tell me how fast my car is. Yeah, you I've have seen, have a, you have I've seen the data slip. log where you told me your car went 380s and it didn't. Huh? 380s. Yeah. You guys told me it went 380s. What car? In this car. Not till late, 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 if I was crazy. That bitch was a fucking turd. It won't be a turd. It wasn't a turd in Dennis. No, it wasn't. And it wasn't in Alabama either. Yeah. Alabama was fast. The fastest I made against Reapers probably one of the fastest passes I made. But Innocent wasn't slow either. You dragged Reaper's ass, huh? Huh? Messed Reaper up? Yeah. Are you talking race? No, I'm not. It's Fuck Reaper. Right. No, I'm just kidding. No. Reaper, Reaper's, Reaper, we left California. He went to uh, Reaper, Mexico. Reaper, you talking about a whole new man. Right? I know. He went to Mexico. Like he got a sleeve. Man he used to be. No, he, got, he went and got a sleeve. While we, when we left and came home, he went there and got a sleeve. And he's lost like 40 pounds. Yeah. And yeah, I mean, he actually looks pretty good. He looks younger, too. He does. He's so, yeah. I've only lost 20 pounds. I still got 50 more pounds to go. My goal was to lose 70 pounds. I kind of let myself go a little bit. And, you know, which I was, I'm fat and happy, you know, but my knees hurt, I'm old, and I just want to get in better shape, so I, I, I told myself, I'm going to lose 70 pounds before this, before No Prep Kings in June, so I've only lost 20, so I still have 50 pounds to go in three months, so I fix that to start working my ass off, so, I mean, if I, what, if I lose 40, I'm close, but I'll still work on it until I get to my 50, but. <laughs> You're going to have to lose more weight now that we didn't find any weight well, in the car. Yeah. <laughs> that's why Dusty took it off. I'm going to gas that. Like, <laughs> oh, that's wrong. <laughs> no, I, I didn't gain weight. We were, talk, <laughs> we were talking about. I've been a fat kid for about some, 10 years. Some things, and Chuck thought there was some weight hung no, in the car. No, there was. And he we can't had, find it. We got. We so, got mounts and shit all... We had like There are five, mounts, but there's no way. We had like five weight bars up top. Okay? And then we, Duffy goes, man, we need to move those lower. So as the season progressed, we moved them underneath the car. And you can see the brackets running. the I car. I see the brackets. Okay? I don't see So then as the season progressed, you know, we had to little, put a little bit more weight up front. Not much, but a little bit. And then all of a sudden, at the end of the season, I'm thinking, man, my car, I know it'll get light enough to put a single on it. And we can make it 2,600 pounds. And that... I'm going to dyno all three right. combinations and see what it'll do. Well, I'm missing that 100 pounds that was in the back. It ain't there. It's got Jimmy Hoffa in the deck lid, though. Man, right. that's a yeah, but, that's a a but I factored that in. I needed, I needed, there needed I'm to be saying, 75 to 100 pounds of weight bars in the back for this car to be able to race it with the right, you know, you can't, just because your car weighs 2,600, it may not work at 2,600. So you got to be able to put weight on it. So I want to make the car 25, 50, and then if we have to, then we have to put 50 or 75 pounds on it, it's fine. So, right. But that 100 pounds is not there. It's not there at so all. I, it, so I think the single deal is out of the question. Because the car can't get light enough, I'm not going to race. I'm not going to race a combination that makes less power and I can't get to the weight. Right. I did that in the death trap. That thing, I only had to weigh 25, 50 in that car and I weighed 2,800. And I did that for season one, two, three, and four. So, it doesn't work out. It doesn't work out. 
So yeah, so I'll be, I'm just gonna test this one with the 88s and the 98s, and hopefully the rules are gonna be out this week, and they give us a little bit of love. <laughs> this week, this week. They, they actually, the rules this are done, week. and they are sent over to the legal, pe legal department to make sure that they're properly spelled and all that stuff. So we're supposed to get the rules this week for No Prep Kings, so that's next up. Um, and then middle of the summer, we'll, we'll do the 405 show again. Um, so we're going to be, it's going to be busy. Right now, it seems like it's really slow. I'm going to do some appearances, so pay attention to my schedule. I'm going to go. Where? I don't know yet. Where? Go do some appearances. I'm going to take the death trap, um, and I'm going to go, like, probably go to Jackson. I like Jackson, Tennessee. I like Brainerd, Georgia. Um, I'm going to go every other weekend. I want to spend some time with my kids. So my kids are at my house. I'm not going to do appearances. So the weekends they're not there, I'm going to do some matches. So in April, probably two in April, two in May. Um, but the other weekends in May, we're going to be testing this car. So this, I'm going to test the rods out of this car until it is, it can compete with the, and if it can't compete, then we'll do something else. But by the first race in June, this thing will be tested and it better be one of the fastest cars out there. If it's not, then I'm going to figure out something. So got to, I'll, I'll change, I'll put a blower, I'll do something. I got enough shit in here I can sell. I'll come up with it. I'll buy another car if I have to. I'll go buy a ProMod like everybody else got. So I'll do something. Anyway, this is the guys that help me. Kevin, Josh, the non-tuner, and then Ben, he is the tuna. Josh Josh cost me four races this season, but I'm still going to hire him for next season. So uh, he'll, do, he'll do a better job. And maybe next season we can go like 19-0 and zero if Josh don't lose me those four races. Hire me for what season? The next season. Of what? Uh, the street show. Oh, the street show. Yeah. Oh. Okay. I mean, I well, we've talked about No Prep Kings. Oh, okay. We've talked about you coming to help me No Prep Kings, so. Oh. I was just, I, you know. Yeah, we talked about it. Just trying to keep up. Yeah. Yeah, it's hard to keep up with me. I'm yeah, out of you're right. And now I've got two arms again. <laughs> now oh, yeah. I can talk. Yeah. Now I was going to say, I, I, I meant talk. to bring some handcuffs. <laughs> I meant I, to bring some. In that sling, I couldn't even talk right. <laughs> now i got my hands back, I can talk. Flappy bird. <laughs> I'll get better and louder as it as it as I go through physical therapy. Your volume. So, yeah, my volume will go louder. Volume. And I can get a little bit more wild as it goes up. You can up. come in hot? Yeah. No, I'm, 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 I wanna, <laughs> come on, come on. Man, I don't want I don't want to fight. I, I really don't want to fight. I'm done fighting. I fought my whole you life. You tried home. to punch the guy from Pennsylvania or whatever. Yeah, you were <coughs> you were swinging your arms around and moving around good that night. He was begging for it. He was begging he, for it. Yeah. He's a, he, I, Everybody told Kevin better go get you. His <laughs> arms are moving. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna punch him in the face. Yeah, I saw. I saw like people that like he. he I saw, he's talk shit and then he didn't even have a car. Then he went and bet sad, money. Yeah. He just want to talk shit. It's sad they didn't put it on TV. Yeah, it was gone. Yeah, you probably made a phone call and said, "Don't." No, I didn't. Yeah, I'm real. I mean, <laughs> they, 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 and they take shit for three shows and put it on one show to make me look that much worse. I'm like. I didn't tell that guy that. I go, oh, last week I told that other guy that. Like, Fuck! Man, I, look thought like a was, dick. I thought it was amazing we put a waste gate back on in like 42 seconds. And, yeah. Oh, no, it was faster than that. We didn't even take the hood off. Y'all did it without taking the hood off. Oh, it showed us taking the hood off? I didn't see that. My non mechanic gas put it back on. Right, man, the waste gate just fell off. Oh, the next thing now, I'm like going back. Yeah, but. And then luckily someone had a Allen or a Allen. Wrench in their that pocket was, or something, Mike. It was that a was Dominator. Yeah, Dominator. They had like a Dominator tool brought a there. tool bag and it had yeah. everything. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> well, Dominator needs a tool bag. Yeah, there. in TV land, all you hear was Hobby going, the waste gate just fell, fell off. And then, and I then like, we staged the car. Then I let go of the button. <laughs> we staged the car and <laughs> yeah. went. Well, and, and yeah, it was kind of a good story because the guy who was talking shit, and he bet me 500 bucks. And I'm like, all right, cool. And then he goes, okay, I win that race. We can race for double. I go, no, 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 no. We didn't race yet. We haven't left the line. It's not a race. Right. He goes, well, I'm not paying that $500. I said, so we're racing for free? Because you didn't win that race. Yeah. And uh, I said, we never negotiated time or anything. If a car breaks, I can fix it in a couple minutes. We fixed it, put an ass open on him, and he didn't, it didn't cost him any money. Yeah. He got out of there because he bet me $500. Bucks. That was nice, though, to, let, to wait for us. He didn't, he didn't have he choice. Did. Well. I promise you he didn't have choice. <laughs> Yeah, I think I even put a hole in the top of my head because I was coming out of the car when he said he went waiting on me. <laughs> and Brendan's like, Brendan's like, no, 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 Chuck, Chuck, I got this, I got this, Chuck. Stay in the car, put your seatbelts back on. And I'm like, that motherfucker, you know. But, no, he didn't have a choice. I mean, I gave him a free race. He didn't have to pay the $500. Um, 
So, but he wanted a free win, and then he would double or nothing. And I was like, nope, that's not. We haven't left the line. You know, at the track, you got two minutes or whatever. whatever they got yeah. rules for that. But on the street, we don't have. We've never negotiated in. Hey, man, if somebody breaks because we could have moved the race to later on in the night. You know. Now, if we were on the line bumping in and something broke, I mean, that's you know, you're tough shit. It but, was the burnout. Yeah, we were doing a burnout. Mm-hmm. So. Wouldn't matter. Like we could have beat him with the wastegate laying off of it. So, in my opinion, it was well, that the night the road was really dirty. I don't know. No, no, that, was no first, that was like the second night we raced. That was the second night. Yeah. yeah, that first night. The first, first night, night was so wet. Yeah, the first night was a dirt, dirt road. Should. I saw the video where you tested on the street, Josh. <laughs> you have seen I it. sent it to your pastor at church. You seen Look it. at Josh <laughs> street racing. There was like hay and stuff on it. It was terrible the, the night before. Josh went down there and got his street cred, made a pass in the car. <laughs> <laughs> lifted, though. He, he made lifted. It. Sean's like, you lifted. I was like, really? Come All on, we need bro. to know is if it I just need to know the first 100 feet. Yeah, I got the reason to run out the back. All right. The back 330. <laughs> that is not the back back, but the back 330. Yeah, yeah but you're, you got your street. That was your, that's your first street pass, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, technically, officially. That was really cool. Officially. Yeah. Gen two stock motor made that many. Well, I mean, it's it's funny that it, it we didn't have no problems with it. It lasted all season, and it hurt a lot of feelings, and it just got faster every single race. And I and I still think, do I think we can take a chance and race it the next the next season? I think we can. I, I don't think we'll go fourteen and four. I think we'll probably lose a couple more unless we negotiate races better. But I still think that like that car is going to be hard. That motor is going to be still going to be hard to beat even next season. I just know how every year people get faster, and we've we've already seen our guys. What well, Dominator put a screw blower? <laughs> Dominator's got a screw blower on that yellow turd, and then uh, Dave's got his new car done. It made like fourteen fifty nine hundred horsepower. Um, I don't know what Doc's doing. Monza built a whole nother car. Um, Reaper, I don't know what Reaper's doing. Um, he lost much weight, so he got to be faster. Um, who else? Kamikaze sold his car, so don't know what he's doing. Um, <laughs> Farm truck and Asian will still have the Jeeps. Who am I missing? Damon's guy's pro mod. Damon, Damon has his X275 car. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's actually a 275 car. With a fresh bullet in it. With, yeah, he, he freshed up the motor. <laughs> so, I can't, he beat, beat me, so I can't really talk shit, but I owe you, Damon. So, I mean, he didn't really outrun us. But I guess he did, because he's first yeah, on the finish he line. He beat us. He beat us. Yeah, he beat us. He beat us fair and square. So, so we're going to race on radials this year? I am. I will tell you right now. If the roads get good, I will have two <laughs> sets of tires and wheels at at every race. Because you told me three the other day on the phone, just saying. I did tell him three. <laughs> I told him a uh, a radial, a pro bracket radial, and a slick. We went from never changing tires to showing up with three sets of wheels. Okay, I learned my lesson. Fuck off. God damn. I said I thought it was just worthless to put a brand new set of tires on it. For one fucking night of racing. Well, guess what? It bit me in the ass. And now I'm not. Now I could have had that sixteen thousand dollars, and I'd give you all each like ten bucks, and then. No, that was not. I negotiated that in my contract. You didn't. Yes, I did. No, you I had a percentage. I didn't sign it. No. I, yeah. I gave. I split the money with y'all evenly. You did, but okay, I had so a cash day provision in there. Well, I didn't read percentage. That. I, you I know you did. You had to read sue it. me on that. <laughs> yeah, I know you didn't read it. I handed it to Josh you. Josh, you didn't read that. In the season, Josh had to sue. Me. I didn't read the fuck contract. I you know. Sign it. I told I you. It. I said read this. I'm not reading that motherfucker. You go, I'm just gonna sign it. I said you should read it. Yeah, I trust you. I just signed it. So he'll turn it over. So legal. you got. He'll turn it over. So legal. you owe me money then. So no, I don't. We had a contract. Did. I gave no. you more money then. I just split it even with this because you know yeah. I'm not a greedy person. You bought me these shoes. I did. Yeah. I would never buy them for myself. <laughs> cool. I yeah, I didn't mind. I didn't mind splitting the money and actually, and I if think we won money, I just split it up. I just got the truck. I was like, all right, we got nine hundred. So what does that divide? And I just, just split it up and we win. I just, I mean, I want the win more than I want the money. I'd rather have a trophy than have money because that mean that trophy means something. I mean, that stuck it in their ass. You know, it's like the money you just spend. But I'm just glad you didn't hurt your shoes when we caught the I forty on fire. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it destroyed mine. It's, it's, so, I, his it, hair was burned off his legs and everything. Off my legs. Josh Conn. There's a fire down there. Fire. <laughs> fire. And and there's just, five of them, four of them. Fire. And Chuck says, go find my wheel. I can't I go, go man, just wheel. look for the wheel because the wheel will be on fire. I don't care about any other parts. He goes, well, I can find them. They're all on fire. And Ben down there stopping the fire out. I picked that wheel up. Burned his hair off his legs. It just went. 
huge fire. I was like, oh my God. <laughs> so I'm up there trying to, I was calling Dave, and of course Josh is not just sitting in the truck. Um, that's not. <laughs> that's what Josh said the first time. He said, I, he said Chuck just sit in the truck and made us go uh, pick up everything. No, I, I was trying to, Dave. I was trying to figure out what we could do, and I was like, we'll just unload the car and just follow the trailer. Well, then the, the fan relay melted, and so it, we didn't make it back to the city, so Dave had to come pick us up. So, anyway, one of them deals. Thanks, it was a fun Dave. season. It was a good yeah, season. Thanks, Dave. Yeah, thanks, Dave. Oh, we know you haven't Dave forgotten, Dave. but thanks. It was like oh, I, always, I, he, I, I would have to pay that back. He gonna call me one time and like he gonna be in Minnesota and go, "Hey man, I need you to pick me up." I'm like, "Fuck, <laughs> this is my payback." Hey, about that, about that one time. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. I don't mind. He helped me. I helped him. So, but overall, it was a good season. I feel like we had the best record. I I'd like to have them four races back that we lost. It'd be awesome. Like at the end of this, like man, can I race you again? Can I race you again? I I think we can win all four of them. I really do. Yeah, because they weren't blowout races. I mean, they were close. I, Every one of them were. Every one of them, the car could have been faster. We 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 had mistakes on every one of our losses. So I would love to race those four losses back. I I would put big money on we wouldn't lose. Why are you looking? Why are you not saying I was, that? I was trying to think of the mistakes. I, I mean. Well, the black car, we didn't have to, I mean, we went faster the next night. Right. The black car, yeah. we just, it was early, and we just didn't go fast enough. Right. He, he just flat out run us and put a half a car us. Yeah. He just outrun us. Yeah. So, but right now, I don't think he can beat me. I know he can't right. beat me. I'm too he wants to race, though. Huh? He wants to race. Oh, I, I'm fucking down. Well, I mean, he's already called, kind of called me in the car out for Texas Radio Roundup, that deal at the end for of the month. My car? Well, he thought I was going to drive it. Oh, okay. Yeah. You got your own damn car. I know. I okay, wash well, I'll race him. I don't need him. your shit. I'll, I'll, I don't I'll, need your piles of shit. <laughs> I'll bring the black car. Oh, well, that's not... He doesn't want to race the black Fuck, car. Fuck, I don't care. It's the same car. How's uh, he know? It was dark. It was dark. That everyone was thinks it was dark black. green. Yeah, yeah everything everyone is thinks black. it was black. So, yeah, and I got a shirt black. that the coyote on it is black. So I'll just show up in that and go, yeah, let's run. What are you going to run for? Uh, Tell him Chuck said yes. Chuck said yes. Yeah. <laughs> Chuck said yes. I mean, that car only go four sixties, but... I think that's fast enough to beat that guy by a lot. Yeah. That car will go for I think he's got a turbo on his car now. You yeah, fuck what he's got. Better put two of them on it. Two of them. Oh, I should have talked he's shit. I'm not, I'm not a radio Brett's racer. A good no, dude. he's a good dude. I like him. Brett's a good dude. I know. I like him. He wanted to tune Monta Jr. up over there. Yeah, well, he yeah. should have <laughs> punched punch punch Brett Monta in the face. Up. No, no, I like Brett. No, I, I didn't have any problems with him at all. I know him and Mons and them got, but goddamn, Brandon's, Brandon talks shit to everybody. And, and it's, maybe, I don't know, there was some kind of, there was some old beef there. Mm. Brett was kind of telling me about it, but I don't, I didn't pay attention to it. Mm. There was some old beef. So, but. I wonder if Junior's ever hit anybody. Daddy, I don't think so. I think like Daddy says he's never done it. He almost hit Kayla once. <laughs> <laughs> That'd have been a bad idea. No, I think Kayla, Kayla would have worked his ass, ass over. <laughs> I wouldn't want to fight Kayla. It's like, she'd knock my fucking teeth out. Yeah, she would have whipped Brandon's ass. Yeah, I, I'm 100% confident. We were out on the street and, he, and terrible. she was racing or something. And then Brandon, I, why he got in her face? I don't know. I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. And Kayla was down. She was thinking I hit him. I was like, God. She's down for whatever. Ugh, I think Monza had to pull him off there too. But anyway. No, I like Brandon. Brandon's a good kid. Brandon's a good kid. He just sometimes gets a little carried away. I do the same shit. I'm older and learning, but I was his age too, and I was a fucking wild child. And I punched a lot of people in the face. I didn't talk about it. I just punched. I, I'm not a very good talker. Like, I'd rather just hit you in the face. Mm. And if you whoop my ass, you whoop my ass. Power to you. I just, I can't sit there and I can't talk very much. I get, I get mad. You don't talk a lot? No, I talk oh, a lot. I can't That's talk confused. if somebody's about calling, you talking about. No, if somebody's calling me a bitch and telling me to do something or telling me to hit them, I usually hit them oh. before they get it out of their mouth. I know that guy goes, hit me first. Hit me first. Do something. Push me. Cross this line. <laughs> yeah. I've already kicked you in the face. Cross this line. <laughs> so, but, uh, I've had a lot of people tell me they're going to punch me. A lot. You got slapped once. I've only had one. That old man slapped left. you off that trailer. I was as I was sitting down. Are we? Can't, can't. I mean, it doesn't matter. I mean, yeah, he, I, and your big ogre ass friend was behind him too. TJ, yeah, and y'all are TJ was there. Yeah, but but TJ worked for. He had to stick up for his boss. He yeah. worked for Odie. Yeah, it was. Well, it was and you, but you, I'm sure. You, I'm, well, I, you, I'm sure you mouthed off to him on the internet or something. Oh, I mouthed off to TJ. Oh. Came and visited me before okay. that. <laughs> <laughs> TJ's not gonna hit you. Though. TJ, TJ, TJ's not gonna hit you. 
EJ was, was big mad. Slap the shit out of you. EJ was big mad when he came. Well, you talk a lot of shit. I'm good That's at, why a lot of people do what I do. That's what a lot of people. Whatever it is, did. I'm good at it. Whatever I'm doing, I'm good at it. A lot of people didn't like you, even when we not here. Like, ah, oh, fuck. Chuck brought Josh. Josh yeah. is a fucking asshole. Well, it's because I. You just I, say you just you speak the truth, and some people don't want to hear the truth. There's yeah, I've been times I don't want to hear the truth either. Yeah. But you speak the truth, and usually you're right. And so the doctor shouldn't have taken your sling off then. Huh? No, <laughs> sling. I don't need that. You don't know nothing about doctor. Fuck you. You better work on power management. You're uh, 0 four right now. Oh, four. four. You got four losses on your record. Uh, and, we're, it, and it's early in 2023, and he's got four losses already. Four losses already. Yeah. Yeah. And it's only March. So. And it's only March. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, that's true. Yeah. Might have to rewrite his contract. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys for checking us out. Um, appreciate you watching all of our videos. I just want to kind of do an end of the season roundup. Uh, obviously, my car did work this season. Kicked a lot of out-of-towners. We're going to have a bunch more out-of-towners coming into town. And uh, there ought to be there ought to be some bunch more racing. And uh, I'm going to be prepared for every one of them. And, and I'm going to help Josh study so we don't have those four L's next season. And... Uh, <laughs> I still, if, if you're coming to Oklahoma City, you're going to have to go through me if you're one of the fastest guys in your group. So just be prepared. And uh, anyway. Thanks. For sure. For sure. Thanks, man. Thanks, Josh. Thanks, Tuna. Hit me. <laughs> Thanks, Tuna. Get your shirts. Uh, yeah, buy some shirts, man. Spend some money, some man. Shirts. My kid's got to eat. Buy some shirts so we yeah. get a fucking haircut. Buy some damn coyote shirts so I can sport <laughs> a haircut. Get a haircut. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I got a shaver at home. I just, it's, this, I, it, I have to hold it. I have to, I have to do this. <laughs> Another couple weeks, I'll be able to shave it. If it bothers you that bad, I, I don't think it next thing you're gonna have a damn man. I don't think I look that good. Look, I ain't that bad. I got hair. Uh, it's getting longer. I, I bought some gel because it's going different ways and stuff. No, it's good. So, see you. I might start doing porn or something. I don't know. I'm <laughs> oh, a different yeah. haircut. <laughs> You're doing so good. I'm going to come up short. Hey, so I guarantee I'm going to come up short if I do porn. That's why I want straight outlaws. Come up short. <laughs>